Hello everybody, welcome back to another day today for more Stray. Last time we uh, did some stuff, we got all the notebooks, and uh, we're going back to see Momo. So we're going to do that now. Slums Part 2. Here we are, funny cat game. Hello, Momo. Look, a note. Little outsider, if you're reading this, it means you're still alive. Excellent. I took some equipment to the bar to take some advantage of their antenna. Come meet me there. I've locked the window, but the code to open it is quite simple. It is... That was my granddad's name. Be careful, it's it's case sensitive. See you at the bar, Momo. Granddad! Or Joe, Joe, Joel. That must be the code of the window near the entrance. Let's go. Yeah, I'll remember that. That's an easy code. Use B12. Look at the window. The code was. It was. Uh, error wrong key. What's my bad? Okay, let's try that again. Hmm. And it was O or was it O? Let's see. Success! It worked! Oh, we got the bar waiting for us. Why do I have a bad suspicion about this? Why didn't he just keep the window open for us? Get out. Let's go to the bar. I remember, uh, I remember where the bar is because uh, the um, people over here. How, how are you doing, my friend? And I and I love tossing bu buckets at each other. Good, clean, fun. Our downtown neighbor disagrees, so we're taking a break right now. All right. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. Oh, I can't knock him over. I was going to be so sad. Throwing buckets, so that sounds pretty fun. I want to throw some buckets. Call me sometime. Meow. Hello, sir. I'm cleaning the porch of my shop again. Stop playing over my shop, you clumsy rascal. I already just said the same thing again. We're at the bar. Hello, sir. I'd like a drink. This is not the bar. This is a laundry mat. <coughs> All right, well, I thought the cat was going to get drunk. I'm a drunk cat down the road. Fuck it. Where is the bar? Wait. Translate. Oh, is that him? Yo, what's up, Momo? Hey, little furball. Come here, I managed to get a signal. All right, sweet. Awesome. Ah, I'm a cat. Come on, Momo, let's see it. You want me to come over here? Oh, you want me to... <gasps> we get to sit down! No! It's too cute. Let me see if I can get this thing working. <clears throat> oh my gosh. I've almost got it. Hello, can anyone hear me? Hello, yes, we can hear you. We are from the slums. We're looking for a way out and... Wait, is that you? Is a ball... Yo, no way! What? Momo. I, I can't believe it. I'm so happy to hear your voice. Where are you? Are the others okay? Yes, we are safe. We found a way up. Hello, do you still hear me? You have to go through the sewers to reach us. Very dangerous. Zerks everywhere. That doesn't sound too well. Sewers? How? Hello? Darn it. We've lost the signal. I can't believe it. He's alive. He and the, and the other outsiders managed to go through the sewers? The sewers are the most dangerous place in the slums, but it's about... It's about... Zour. It's a hard name to say. Made it. There must be a way. No, <laughs> the cat turned. You'll never get past the sewers. It's infested with zooks. They'll make a quick meal out of you. Especially you, little one. Oh, trust me. I know the damage they can do. Many tried with their luck in the past. Doesn't end with Anyway, I warned you. Your business is none of my business. There has to be a way to, like, get rid of them, right? Seamus. Jacob, his father Doc used to be a great scientist. 
He was working on some new weapon to fight the Zerks. A few years ago, he went off to test the device and never came back. Seamus has never been the same since. We know Doc, we just talked to him. Meow. Don't listen to Seamus, he's just scared like like I was. If Doc built a weapon, that's our ticket to join the Outsiders. I remember that. In his notebook, Doc mentioned a secret lab a few times. It must be aware, that must be where he was working on it. There might be a clue in Seamus' apartment. Come on, follow me. As a cat, I'll do that. This is just too cute, okay? Lead me the way. I am a cat. We are walking very slow. This game is amazing looking. I love it. Might not wanna... Yeah, he's a bit angry, man. You'll get there. What's this hooligan doing? Hello, I am Cat. Come on, so you missed open the door. You know your father would have wanted to help us. Well, that was back to it. This situation is pretty tough on Seamus. He doesn't want to hear about the outsiders anymore. He won't help me. But you? I think I have an idea. We're going to turn you into a super cat. Like Sonic. Oh, we're going to break in. Time to commit crimes. Let's go. Here, take Doc's notebook and show it to Seamus. It contains a lot of information that will hopefully act as an electroshock. Find the secret lab, little outsider. I'm going back to the bar to try to re-establish re communication with the others. You're my best friend. Alright, let's go. Yo, brother. What? What are you doing here? I told you. Get through the sewers. Getting through the sewer suicide mission. Leave me be. What's that? Wait. Is this my papa's? Oh, wow. I never knew. There's a secret room here in our flat? But where? Sheet music. That's all I've got. Where is a good question? I don't have anything else to show him. Cute. Translate? Time will tell. Hey, buddy. We're breaking stuff and we're finding stuff. Oh, where did you come from? Time will tell. That's some kind of clue? I don't know, but I could break more stuff if you want me to. I mean, we're kind of just destroying his house at this point. Oh. <gasps> Use Digicode. We haven't found a code yet. We need to find a code. Oh my gosh. Why did I look at the... Two five one one two five one one two five one one two five no 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 yes I don't know what thing at the big hand I've never seen this room. I can't believe he managed to hide it from me all this time. These blueprints, they must be for a Zerk weapon. Papa has always been so secretive with his work. He told me the weapon was working in theory, but it needed a real life test. It went outside in the slums and he never came back. Wow. Papa knew that the Zerk are no, officially no longer under control. They now eat metal. Holy. Q.
I almost had something in it. Oh, I have a bag. What's going on? Find anything interesting in here? No. Ooh, here we go. Broken tracker. Aosimus. Well, I remember that. That's his tracker. Pop always used tracker to keep an eye on where I was. Maybe we can reverse it to find where he went. I can't believe my papa might still be alive. I've missed him so much. You need a weapon for the Zergs, right? My papa definitely took one with him. We must need to repair the tracker so we can find them. Someone in the slums maybe should be able to help. Come with me, I'll open the door for you. Perfect. We're getting somewhere. <laughs> the code. Let us out. Well, who can help? <laughs> you gotta figure track here. Your resources might be someone in the slums to help you. Alright. You're no help. But I'll talk to you anyway. Clean the porch again. Stop playing over my. Okay. Didn't think so. What about you? You guys clean the paint again. Sure, it's making all of it. It's just a tracker. I don't know anything about high tech stuff. Try the bar. Oh, yeah. Well, why don't we try. Hey, are you still here, bro? Momo. I'm really struggling to get the connection back. Did you find anything interesting in at Seamus? Entrance advice, but it looks broken. Maybe someone in the village can help you repair it. Did you ask for the, at the. We're at the bar. Hey, buddy. What a beautiful object and rare too. I know a guy who fixed stuff like this. Very talented, just a little. Well, you'll see. Then Elliot is off to the left of here in your grandma's shop. There are all signs over. There are signs all over his door. Okay. Thank you, sir. Elliot shop. Uh, okay. I don't know where any of that is. Do any of you know Elliot? Probably Zach. Me. Okay. Yeah, no, I'm good. the last one so it's over here right, Elliot programming are you Elliot <clears throat> us grandma a poncho I'd like a poncho the alleyways This is where we started at. Yeah. Alright, here we go. Probably the door and wait for us to open. Alright. Hello. Come on. Let me meet you. What?
You're here for Elliot? He's just over there. Okay. Yo, Ellie. Yes, can I help you? Oh wow, that's a great tracker. I recognize this model. It's the Hami BR2000. You can track anyone with this little gadget. May I? I know how to repair it. When I'm trembling like this, I can't use my keyboard. I don't know if I'm sick or something, but I definitely don't feel right. I can't work while I'm shivering like this. I think I need a blanket to be able to fix your tracker. Alright, we gotta... We gotta find broken wire somewhere then. We... Is this something? I can't think so, okay. Broken wire. If we can find broken wire somewhere... I don't know where we would find broken wire. Remember. Scientific mate. It's remarkable that human and genuine found a way to create plants that thrive without sunlight. Organic life requires trees to purify the, the city's air. Robots don't need it, but they take care of them anyway. It's what humans would have wanted. Well, we don't know what to do now. So, what I'm going to do is end the episode here because my computer is on fire and, uh, well, I have done a lot today. Hope you all enjoyed. I'll see you guys next time. Have a great day. Thanks for watching. Next time on Stray. That's a new outro.